So in the culinary arts and baking and pastry program, students can earn a basic certificate of achievement, an advanced certificate of achievement, as well as an optional associate's degree if they pair the general ed requirements with those certificate requirements. If a student is able to go full-time, they can finish the basic certificates in about a year, two semesters, and then the advanced certificates would be an additional year. Students that graduate from our program are eligible for certification as a certified culinarian by the American Culinary Federation Educational Foundation. In the program, we start with the fundamentals of cookery. We really start at the beginning, how to set up your station, how to work safely. Basic knife skills, sauce preparation, vegetable cookery, starches. They learn how to mop, they learn how to sweep, they learn how to wipe off the counter. We learn how to make breads, how to make cookie doughs, croissants and danishes. So it's really the fundamentals. It's getting down the primary science behind things. The baking and pastry program is comprehensive. From the very beginning, making rolls to artisan bread, it can then go into a more advanced techniques of making French pastries, wedding cakes, tempering chocolate, or pulling sugar. When you move into the culinary classes that are in our advanced certificate, we have a la minute and a banquet style service that take place here in the captain's table. All of the kitchen is students. They make all of the food from scratch and then prepare it for guests that come in for a lunch service and a dinner service. And then uh, the front of the house staff is also a class. So the servers, the managers, the hostess, those running the food it is all part of that, uh, the courses that are part of the culinary program. And then we also offer Garmage and Advanced Garmage, which focuses on charcuterie, cheese making principles, curing some drying, sausage making, uh, force meat preparation, and then focus on the cold arts of hors d'oeuvres and salads and appetizers that we can use in banquet and buffet service. As part of the program, students are working in our cafeteria operation for one of their on-campus internships, and they rotate through the different stations that we have established in those kitchens. But then they also work in our recovery kitchen, preparing food items that will help to feed the food insecure on campus and in the uh, Orange County area. We're super excited that we have a brand new state-of-the-art facility with state-of-the-art equipment induction cooking ranges, computerized ovens. We have additional kitchens, including a cold kitchen. It's our first year being in this new kitchen and this kitchen is just like everything that you could ever ask for as a culinary student and more. I love the culture of OCC in general. The culinary industry itself and just the restaurant industry especially is very daunting and scary, but I think it's a nice balance of both. You're constantly being pushed to new expectations and to get better and become a better chef, a better leader, better communicator, just learning from the people around you. And a lot of these people that are my teachers now, I would even consider more like mentors. I am in the OCC culinary program as a second career. I had zero culinary experience. I was in over my head, totally thrown off the deep end, but I've been loving every minute of it. OCC's culinary arts program is extremely unique because we have top-notch staff. We have chefs and sous chefs and executive chefs coming in. Some are part-time, some are have been here for years and years. It's top-notch education, but it's super approachable. You know, we offer classes Monday through Friday, and it's affordable. There's an expression, find your passion. And what we are able to do here at Orange Coast College is to allow students the opportunity to experience their passion.